Okay, this is a little game hunter here with his Crossman Twist 800X 22 caliber pellet gun. Um, today I'm going to be doing a penetration test through an inch thick piece of plywood. Um, so first, the first pellet up is the Crossman pointed pellet. Um, as you can see, I'm going to be shooting from point blank range. Um, the pellet did go all the way through it. Um, that's the crossman pointed. Did go all the way through the wood. The next one is the RWS lead free hunting pellet. from point blank range. Okay, that right that right there doesn't look good. Let's see. Oh yes it did. It penetrated through did the back of the tip did go through it. Um, but the bat part got stuck in the wood. Um, next up is the Predator Poly Mag. The Predator Poly Mag hunting pellet. Um, point blank range. Um, it does not look like it went through it. No, it did not. Predator Polymag did not go through it. You can see it stuck right in there. Um, the next up is the Bean and Kodiak. The same exact pellets. The Bean and Kodiak. point blank range and um as you can see it did go straight through um came out the back right there and last but not least is the beam and crow magnum the beam and crow magnum pellet Um, point blank range. And you see that left a very clean hole straight through it. No problems. And exploded out the back. See, whoa, you can see what happened there. Tore the piece of plywood up. So, um, you can see the penetration. All of them did go through, except for the Predator Poly Mad, which is stuck right there. Um, Kodiak and the Crow Magnum had the best results, the cleanest hole. As you can see, it just tore the back of it up when it came out. Um, and this is one inch thick plywood. Um, and remember, this is the little game hunter with his Crossman Twist 800X 22 caliber pellet drum. Um, hope this video was informative. Thanks for watching.